Okay, so uh, look over here. Now, when we are looking at this particular image, right? It says platform design. All right. Now, platform design can also you can say as the architecture. Now, in this architecture diagram, which you can see, right? Uh, you can see how the Fortigate platform adds strength without compromising your flexibility. Okay, meaning that there are a couple of features. I mean, we have already seen that the Forti OS is added. And there is one particular newer concept, which is called as the security processing units, also called as SPUs. Okay. Now on top of this, so basically you have the hardware on top of the hardware, you have something called as SPUs. Now with the help, so hardware and the SPUs basically are more or less uh, working similarly. Okay. Now apart on top of this SPUs, you will have the 40 OS. And on top of this 40 OS, you have the all the UTM features that we have, such as antivirus, web filter, IPS, and so many more. Okay. Now there are a couple of more devices such as 40 web. You have 40 mail, which is a dedicated mail mail device. 40 sandbox, just like you have something called as wildfire, right? In your Palo Alto, more or less the same stuff. Okay. 40 client is an endpoint software. Okay. Just like you might have heard about Cisco AnyConnect, right? exactly the same thing okay now the forty client is also just like your cisco any connects which uh, you know helps you to connect to the vpn uh ipsec vpn ssl vpn apart from this it also gives you the power to make sure that whatever the win system that you are on those systems are updated or not okay only then it will allow you to connect to the VPN. all right now what we are seeing over here is something which is called as the spus right now, what exactly is this SPU? Now, most FortiGate models have uh, specialized acceleration hardware, which is called as this uh, security processing units, right? Okay. Now, um, these security processing units uh, can offload the resource, uh, uh, resource intensive uh, information or the resource intensive traffic from your CPU. Okay. That is, that is the um, functionality or you can say unique feature when it comes to FortiGate because whatever the traffic is as soon as it enters the FortiGate firewall first of all it goes to the cpu okay as soon as it hits the cpu the cpu decides whether to offload that traffic to the security processing unit or not okay but in all the cases we have different different spus or uh, ACE hardware ASIC chips that you know handle different different kinds of traffic so packet flow ingress and the egress 